All right, we're back and entering the ring right now. The first half of this match will be B.J. Whitmer, part of the A squad now, with his manager, Brock Guffman. Let's go over the introduction. The following contest is scheduled for one fall and is a singles match. Introducing first, hailing from Cincinnati, Ohio, with Brock Guffman, B.J. Whitmer. And his opponent. Well, B.J. Whitmer, along with the uh, sports agent extraordinaire, Brock Guffman, set to take on a, a guy who will flat get up in your face, and he will do everything he can to rip you limb from limb. Talking about the tough Johnny the Bull and Hoss for the introduction. Hilly from Brooklyn, New York, he is Johnny the Bull. All right, young B.J. Whitmer. Two tours with uh, Pro Wrestling Noah in Japan under his belt but a real test for it in the back alley brawler in the name of Johnny the Bull. And less in this one, we're gonna ask the question, can Johnny the Bull make B.J. Whitmer an offer he can't refuse? <laughs> Brock Guffman's made quite a few offers to quite a few people, but most of them are refused. Yes, exactly. Right now, the Bull ducking out of the way, B.J. Whitmer taking issue with it. Folks, yes. while we have the opportunity, we wanna remind you next Saturday, February 2nd, Heartland Wrestling returns to Batavia, Ohio at the Red Barn Flea Market. A 7.30 p.m. bell time with a super lineup and advanced tickets on sale now at the Red Barn. That's next Saturday night in Batavia. Yes, and coming up Wednesday, February the 6th, Oscars Nightclub at 700 Pete Roseway in Longworth Hall in Cincinnati. Opens their doors to the ASWA bell time, 8 p.m. Oh, wait a minute. The bull going for that hip toss. B.J. Whitmer blocks it, block and block again. Boy, these guys... Jockeying for position and out. Oh, wait a minute! Oh, oh. Johnny the Bull caught him and just hip tossed Whitmer right over that top rope. Boy, the Bull, what power he's got. And now he's on top of him, referee Robert Briscoe, trying to calm this thing down and having no success. Man, on that reversal, it looked like Bull caught him just as Whitmer was trying to reverse one himself and Bulls. Slingshot him right over that top rope. But right now, Bull, and I think he's made an offer that Whitmer wishes he could refuse at this point, Jim. Well, Whitmer is hoping that he can refuse it. Right now, Bull all over him. He's back in the ropes over there. And the Bull doing what he does best, and that's being physically intimidating. He is so stocky and so strong, compact, well put together as the Bull. Wait a minute, there was a suplex. Chose not to go for the lateral press. He's just pounding Whitmer with his closed fist, and Briscoe dangerously close to disqualifying Johnny the Bull. Right now, Bull rips the uh, shoelaces down across the eyes of B.J. Whitmer. And stomping on his hands now, Bull, not an orthodox human being in terms of wrestling knowledge, but certainly a very effective one, enough so that Mike Sanders has made him his bodyguard. What's oh, he wait, doing wait, now? Wait, what is he he's trying to position him? And Oh, look, he's trying to tie his legs up in the ropes. Yeah, the Bull tying Whitmer's legs up in the ropes so that he can stomp him and kick him at will. And the Bull being very questionable in his tactics here. Now spring oh. leg drop. No for, nowhere for Whitmer to go. Boy, we're seeing some action already in the program. Wait a minute, lateral press there. Briscoe with a count of two, couldn't make it stick. Later on in the program, we're gonna see the new HWA heavyweight champion, R.C. Haas. That's gonna be a tremendous matchup later. And also the cruiserweight champion. But right, oh, right now, that was once again, very close to a two count, Les. Yes, Whitmer firing back. Shooting those little forearms in, slowing Johnny the Bull down. Goes to the arm with Bull, reverses it on him. We see where Bull with that oh. power. Spine buster on Whitmer. He's going to took the leg as he got him. He got the two. Whitmer hanging tough in there and giving Johnny uh, quite a battle up to this point, Jim. Well, you, you know, Guffman on the outside trying to call in advice to his man, B.J. Whitmer, who was not ready for what he... Uh, what he has stepped into here, I don't believe. We haven't seen a lot of offense out of Whitmer in his contest. The bull is so intimidating and so imposing. Now he's got that surfboard and he's got it locked in. Whitmer, you gotta give it to him. He's been courageous enough not to give up. And he is certainly, uh, he's certainly still in the fight, but he uh, has been buffaloed so far by the big bull. Yes, his offense has been held down, extremely so. He's not been able to go to the air, and that, of course, is Whitmer's strong suit. Wait a minute, Whitmer from behind, belly to back suplex. Caught the bull unaware. Guffman is beside himself, and that is a very ugly pair. Wait a minute, the bull, the bull turned Whitmer over. Whitmer caught the brunt of that belly to back on the back of his own head. Yeah, here's where you thought Whitmer needed to come back strong, get into this thing offensively, and he's been unable to do that. Bull back to his feet first, 
So Whitmer was unable to succeed in building an offense. And look at here, Bull now taunting him, but shoots that right hand that drops him and turns him upside down. Whitmer now face first down on the mat as Bull continues to methodically and systematically take apart young B.J. Whitmer. Now going for a full scoop slam. Where's he gonna put him? Oh, he picked the spot and he put him down. Guffman is worried. The Bull is going for something, not sure what. Top side. Oh, wait a minute, but he's not watching. He is not watching. He's got his back turned to Whitmer. Whitmer's on his feet. The Bull obviously is completely and totally lost here. Oh, oh. I don't know what he was doing there, but it didn't work well. He's trying for the leg drop. Whitmer waiting for him, caught him in midair. <laughs> Whoa, man. Well, you just basically got to say that bulls are not the smartest uh, animals in the in the barnyard because <laughs> the bull had this thing well in hand, but he tried to get fancy, tried to get cocky, and young B.J. Whitmer, with an all-or-nothing proposition, got all the bull, powerbombed him down, and now Whitmer has changed this momentum. There you go, the first offense, the strong offense for Whitmer's right here, and it all stems out of bull. Being slow on the draw off that top rope, Whitmer was able to catch him with that power bomb. Whitmer shooting those forearms, and man, he needs to bring out the heavy artillery here. Bull, Whoa, for the Bull up and over. Once again, took his eye off the ball. Wait a minute, German suplex. He's got him two and no, just barely. Man. Thought Whitmer was going for an upset there. Johnny the Bull evidently never took T-ball when he was seven years old. They would have told him, don't take your eye off the ball. <laughs> he's done it twice. Whitmer going topside. Now let's see if he's going to be any more effective out of this than Bull has on, been on his two trips to the well. Oh, wait a minute. Bull had him planted, had himself planted there. Tremendous center of gravity on this young man. And now he's muscling Whitmer over, going for the power slam. Whitmer slides behind, swinging a miss on the clothesline. Went for another one, but Bull ducks under. They're just... They're just manhandling each other at this point. Exactly. Bull, it's worn down here, but still throwing those big right hands. Whitmer, unable to build ahead of steam here. He's going for the up and over. Bull catches him on the shoulder, spins him, drops him face first. Not sure what that was. Well, it's but very it, reminiscent of what we just saw Sean O'Hare take out Noble with, and now the Bull takes out B.J. Whitmer, spun him and dropped him, and that was it. Bull made a couple of crucial mistakes but Whitmer was not able to capitalize. No, he certainly wasn't, so Bull pulls this one out. Not a strong win, but a win nonetheless for Johnny the Bull. And we'll be back with more HWA action right after this. <laughs> 